What do you believe about your own masculinity? I think the answer for that is shown in the way you carry yourself. Now, many people pass for confident. There are many high achievers, if you will. But are they really confident? Or are they driven? Now, it's, there's a massive difference because driven people, they overcompensate for some inner weakness, for some inner trauma. On the other side of the spectrum, you have people who are so-called withdrawn and shy people that wouldn't venture forth, wouldn't take risks, wouldn't even express themselves. And yeah, that might be their character, but I don't think it is. I think our characters are revealed in us because of our past. And you have those people, the withdrawn people, the withdrawn men on the other side of the spectrum. What do they believe about their masculinity? I can tell you because I was one of them. You believe bad things about yourself and you act out on those beliefs. Examine yourself, examine your inner motives. Going back to the confident men, a lot of what passes for confidence out there is just bravado. It's people who are, who are so bold to the point of just maybe being too much or even too masculine or too aggressive. What have they got to cover over? What weakness? How do they see themselves so that they need to keep stepping up, so that they need to keep standing out? It's, look at me, I can do it, look at me. Well, maybe it's coming out of a belief that you can't do it, that you are weak, that you are wounded, that, that you are not good enough, maybe. Same with the other guy, same with the withdrawn people, which is what I was. Maybe that's rooted in the same sort of weakness, but it's dealt with in a different way, depending on your personality, your background, and how, what relationship you, you had with your father. It is worth examining this, because then we'll get to the, to the truth. And the truth about your masculinity is that it's good. It's actually very, very good. And that's what we need to get. We need to get back to that golden goodness that we've all had and we lost. Let's get it back.